All right, so today is the finally the day when uh, I get my road armor bumpers put on. But um, I'm getting a road armor stealth front and rear bumper, and I'm getting a worn 16.5 winch. And I've only got a two and a half inch ready lift on it right now. But what I want to do is measure from the ground to the bottom of the fender right there, and that way I know, you know, how much it sinks it down. Because I'm probably going to have to put a, a bigger lift on the front because I don't want to look like I'm plowing snow all the time. But uh, so what I'm going to do is just get a measurement real quick from the uh, ground to the top of that fender. Let's see if I can get this little tripod set up. All right, if you can even see. Look. This first line right here, we're looking at right at 45 inches. So once I put the, uh, the bumper and the winch on the front, I'll get a measurement again and see if it drops down any. Which that winch is pretty heavy, but I, I'm replacing the uh, steel cable with synthetic rope, so it should lighten it up a good bit. But uh, anyway, once I get everything put back on, we'll have another uh, video and see what everything looks like. So stay tuned. Sorry, excuse the mess, but you can't really rearrange a garage with these big bumpers here. But as you can see, front armor, road armor rear bumper on the top, front bumper on the bottom. And then I got this uh, worn 16.5. It, it come with the steel cable, but I put this synthetic on here. We're gonna put that on. So should lighten it up a good bit. All right, so we're finna put these bumpers on. Got the bumpers. Oh, truck's locked. Got the bumpers and then the worn 16.5. She's gonna look good. All right, guys, uh, just got done doing the workout. Um, right before that, I picked up my truck. I'm just gonna do a quick video real quick, just kind of show what it looks like. And I'll do a more in-depth video later when I go ahead and uh, put the lights in the bumpers and everything else like that. But this is what it looks like. So officially have no more chrome. Uh, got the uh, road armor front stealth bumper. Got a worn 16.5 in there. I put the synthetic rope. Um, I got this, uh, uh black fair lead it's the worn epic fair lead uh, i wanted it black uh the worn epic hook was on back order so i'm just using this for right now It'll, they said it'd be in any, any time within the next week um so that'll be changed out then but uh i'm super pumped uh I'm, of course you know i've got to fill in the, the the lights but i'm gonna wire that up myself um and then i got the rear bumper as well so i just I hate chrome that was the last bit of chrome i had on the truck so i'm super pumped i think it turned out awesome it looks better than i thought it did um here's the old bumpers my neighbor's got an f-250 he backed into something so i'll probably give him my back bumper and i'll just throw that in the, in the attic or whatever if i ever decide to sell my truck i'll throw it back on keep my bumper because if i ever did get rid of it i'd probably get the same thing in like a the 7.3 so I'd get probably like a 20 20 7.3 um, but I'm um, I measured it last time I was gonna see how much it dropped it down um, I don't think it dropped it down too much it was I think 45 inches uh, to the fender I was gonna see what the weight of the uh, bumper and the winch dropped it down to so we'll see uh, yeah. it was at it was at 45 so Yeah, it dropped it down about a quarter of an inch, so it's 44 and three quarters. That ain't as bad as I thought, but I'm still probably gonna throw probably another one inch puck on the bottom. Well, I got a two and a half inch ready lift now. I'll probably go with the three and a half just to raise it up. I hate looking like I'm piling snow, but um, uh, I'm, this is just a quick video just to kind of show you, and I'll go more in depth later. But uh, I'm super pumped. Uh, let me know what y'all think. Uh, let me know in the comments. I'm gonna get some shackles here for the front and the rear. Let me know if you if I should get black shackles or red. I'm kind of undecided. Um, I'm looking at that Factor 55. Uh, it's not really a hook. It's a closed winching system. It's like the little circle one that busts up to the fair lead. That way it won't scratch it. It's rubberized. Um, I'm looking at either black or red on that too. So let me know what you think. Uh, I'm going to get the, the, the two shackles in the, in the rear as well. 
but uh let me know in the comments what you think black or go with red shackles uh it is gonna look good but anyway i appreciate y'all watching and like i said i'll do a more in-depth video next time but i gotta do some stuff around the house and gotta get ready to go do some things so i'll just post this up real quick and let me know what y'all think but appreciate y'all watching and don't forget let me know about them shackles appreciate y'all